Greetings from Penguin City. This is Dan Rivers. A friend said they'll have to miss church because their kids had a birthday party Sunday morning, 9 o'clock at Chuck E. Cheese. What? Sunday morning? In my town, there were three grocery stores, two hardwares, one drugstore, three beer joints, and they were all closed on Sunday. You get the point. Sunday was downtime. Even when my kids played Little Indians football, football was Sunday afternoon. At my church, we've had a surge of grade school kids participating, and then the parents follow. I see something good happening there, but overall, we're losing our country incrementally. Sunday was sacred to the people of the 60s and the 70s. Sunday was a time for families, visiting. We would show up unannounced, no warning, the pop-in, always welcome. There wasn't that much to do on Sundays, so we visited, we talked. That changed with the seven days shopping cycle. The parents shopping on Sunday, now the kids have activities. I suppose it sounds old fashioned, but if you have the power to do so, say no to sports on Sunday morning. Our way of life is at stake. The family is being dismantled incrementally. I don't think it's by design, but it's turning away from God, worshiping of sports. I wonder if the kids really want to be that busy. If you have the power to do so, insist there be no extracurricular activities until Sunday afternoon. Is that too much to ask? Maybe even a little family time. Even if it's not church, how about breakfast together? Not too many kids would argue with bacon and eggs. I'm Dan Rivers. That's my story. Join me weekday mornings at 9 on News Radio 570 WKBM.